Hello guys, in this tutorial, I'll show you how to fix high ping on your Windows 11 or Windows 10 computer. If you're experiencing lag and high ping while gaming, this guide will help you reduce ping and improve your online gaming experience. Just follow along step by step, it's super easy. Alright, let's start and follow the steps. Right click on the start icon and select run from the menu. Once the run window opens, type re-get it and click OK or press enter on your keyboard. A prompt will appear asking for permission. Click yes to continue. The registry editor window will now open. Before making any changes, it's always a good practice to create a backup of the registry. To do this, go to file, then click on export. Choose a location to save the backup and give it a name for the backup and click save button to save the backup file. If you ever need to restore your registry settings, simply go to file, then click on import and select the saved registry backup file. It will restore your backup registry setting. Once you are done, navigate to H key local machine in the registry editor, then expand software, scroll down and locate Microsoft, then expand it. Look for Windows NT, Expand it. Inside Windows NT, find current version and expand it. Under current version, locate multimedia and expand it. Inside multimedia, find system profile and click on it. On the right hand side, locate network throttling index. Right click on network throttling index and select modify. In the value data field, enter FF, 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 F, eight times F, Click OK to save the changes. Close the registry editor window. This tweak optimizes network performance and can help improve speed related issues. Then right click on the start icon again and select run. In the run dialog box, type ncpa.cpl and click OK. This will open the network connections window. Identify your active connection. If you're using a wired connection, select Ethernet, and if you're using Wi-Fi, select Wi-Fi. Right-click on the active connection and choose Properties. In the Networking tab, scroll down and select Internet Protocol version 4, TCP slash IPv4. Click on Properties. New window will open. In the new window, select Use the following DNS server addresses, and in Preferred DNS server, type 8. 8.8.8 and in alternate DNS server type 8.8.4.4. These are Google's public DNS servers which can improve DNS resolution speed and reduce latency in online gaming. Click OK to save the changes. Restart your connection for the settings to take effect. After it's done, right click on the start icon again and select device manager. Once the device manager opens, locate and expand network adapters. Identify your active network adapter. If you're using a wired connection, look for Realtek PCI GBE family controller or a similar Ethernet adapter. If you're using Wi-Fi, find your wireless adapter. Right click on the adapter and choose properties. Then navigate to the advanced tab. Here, adjust the settings for optimal performance. Set the 802.11 a slash b slash g slash n mode to dual band if available, enabling both 2.4 GHz and 5 GHz. Ensure the channel width for both 2.4 GHz and 5 GHz is set to auto. If fat channel intolerant is disabled, enable it. For roaming aggressiveness, if your router is nearby and you have strong signal strength, sell it to lowest or medium for better stability. A higher setting can cause unnecessary network switching, which may reduce speed. Under preferred band, if your adapter supports both 2.4 GHz and 5 GHz, select prefer 5 GHz as it provides faster speeds and lower latency. Click OK to save the changes and restart your computer for the settings to take effect. After the reboot, test your internet speed and ping to see if there's an improvement. That's it for today's video. I hope this guide helped you fix the issue and improve your network performance. If you found this video useful, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to the channel for more tech tips and tutorials. 
Also, let me know in the comments if this solution worked for you or if you have any questions. I'll be happy to help. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.